You are almost at the finale. What what was going through your head when Ryan called your name? Oh gosh, so many things. I was just, you know, I'm really honored to be in the top three just because of how how incredible this top 12 has been. Mm -hmm. You can go all the way to the top 48. We've had unbelievable talent. And to still be here now is an honor, and I'm really proud of, of uh, you know, the journey and everything. Mm -hmm. And I was, I was, I didn't know how tonight was going to go down, but it was awesome when I heard my name and that I'm going to be in the finale. So it's crazy. That's crazy. Did you, obviously when you auditioned, you, you were hoping to be in the finale. Did you ever think it would actually be happening like this, though? No. And really, the reason is because I never really thought of about it too much because there's so many variables that come into play mm -hmm. when you're when you're going for the first audition all the way to the finale I mean there's so many things that come into play and happen and cuts happen and really great people go home mm -hmm. there are countless people who are good enough to win in the first audition in Nashville on my day the, there are tons of people who are good enough vocally to win but it's not always just about the vocal ability. It's about the whole package. It's about your ability to perform. It's about your ability to, ability to execute. You may be an um, unbelievable singer, but what comes out of you when you have 90 seconds to sing or less, and you have all these people and you have little sleep and you have to learn new songs, what happens? You know, that's a factor that is a huge part of it. So, but you know, there's so many factors that I never really thought about being in the finale, but now that it's I'm here, here it's, it's here it's in, it's insane I never yeah. thought about it how, how was it going back home and seeing everyone and seeing you, literally your entire town come out for you yeah I've I've I grew up in White House I was born in Nashville mm -hmm. and then I think when I was about nine I moved to White House family moved to White House and I've never and not the White House the city White House White, White House Tennessee <laughs> just up 65 north exit 108 uh, like 20 miles north Nashville uh, I've never seen the city come out so and such support like that for anything ever even like fourth of july where everybody comes out i mean it was really a sight to see and it made my heart very warm and you you said you saw your dad cry right yeah just on the package tonight i didn't even know oh. yeah i didn't even know he teared up or anything oh. but that was the first time i saw it was watching it on stage and tonight you had to perform right after which i'm sure right. was difficult right it was yeah it was hard but yeah it was it was incredible. I mean, he's so proud, and he was a musician for a long time, and it was so good. And and I hate that he didn't make it, but it's almost like you know now I'm I'm here trying to do it for him, you know, kind of in honor of him. Right. So it meant a lot to see that it's touching him so deeply. Totally. And did you did you have your Champions fried chicken that we were talking about no, last week? Uh, no. It was in Chattanooga. It's hard to get oh, to. Oh, okay. I thought I was right in Nashville. But I did have uh, Jack's Barbecue right on Trinity Lane. Okay. That's some good southern food. Good yeah. sweet tea, good barbecue, good brisket, good uh, good everything. Oh, that was nice. It. Yeah. Not, now, now I'm hungry. Yeah, me too. What, what can you tell us for finale? Do we have songs? Do we have themes? What can you tell Man, us? We, we don't have nothing. I don't know <laughs> what we're doing. They haven't told us much. And, you know, it's just because they don't want to tell us what we're doing in the finale because we got enough to worry about, you right. know? So I'm sure we're going to hear right after this, right over this, or maybe in the morning. But whatever it is, I, I'm telling you, uh, whatever it is, I'm going to do all I've got and put everything I have into it. And this week is going to be crazy, but, I, man, I, I just feel like I'm just so full of gas. So f I, My gas tank is full, and I'm ready to just explode, man. I'm I'm ready to go after anything they put at me. I'm ready to kill it. You know? I've, I've said this to you before, but you could really tell how much you love music. And I know that the people are seeing that too. So I wish you the best of luck next week. Thank I will you. be seeing you. Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you so much.